Hello everybody, welcome to Men's with PJ. Today's date, April 10, 2016. Our discussion is going to be on Mediator. Now, this is interesting. I mean, I kind of knew what it was, but I still look it up anyhow to make sure. Well, Mediator, as a plural nine, noun, is mediators. It's a person who attempts to make people involved in a conflict to come to an agreement or as a go-between. The government appointed a mediator to assist in finding a resolution to a dispute. Now, a syn synonym for this is arbitrator, uh, arbiter, negotiator, conciliator, peacemaker, go-between, middleman, intermediator, uh, interviewer, intercessor, broker, honest, broker, liaison, officer. Now, we know in Job's, 9, 32 through 33, and I cannot defend myself, for you are no mere man as I am. If you were, then we could discuss it fairly. But there is no umpire between us, no middle man to, or mediator to bring us together. In Acts 7, 38, how true this true to be, for in the wilderness, Moses was the go-between, the mediator between the people of Israel and the angel who gave them the law of God, the living word on Mount Sinai. Now, we know that sometimes Job knew uh, during an argument or a dispute that there needs to be a go-between or a mediator to help negotiate. Moses ended up being the mediator between God and the Israelites. Sometimes during divorce or even a trial, when no one can come to an agreement, then a mediator is needed or appointed to resolve or negotiate everything in the dispute. Because Jesus Christ completed his mission of salvation, becoming the Redeemer, he is now our mediator before God. This is an interesting concept, but Jesus will mediate for you. All you need to do is believe him completely with your whole heart, mind, and soul. And you, you need to believe that he is your Lord and Savior. I want you to think about this today. Have a blessed day, and God bless.